Welcome back. We are here looking at the foreign exchange market. This is going to be my daily forecast for Wednesday, March 24th, 2021. If you like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner. Hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos. And you're welcome to join us over at Patreon. The link is down below. So we we'll start by looking at the Great British Pound and the US dollar. And this has been an absolutely brutal day for the market as a whole. So the US dollar index has appreciated significantly today. And that has also affected these currency pairs uh, significantly. So we can see that the US uh, Great British Pound US dollar is down the 0 0.69 at its current stage. We are heading towards the 100 moving average right here at uh, 1.369. And that is most likely where we'll have find the support next. So we have broken down from the 50 minute week average. We did not manage to break above the 20 and the 40. And then we just had to, headed south towards the 100 minute week average. We're getting significantly overstretched here. So it may well be that we'll have a pullback towards the 50 minute week average before we go lower. We can see that we're way outside the bottom here at the Bollinger Band. Um, technical indicators otherwise are very bearish at this point. MACD has entered negative territory. Uh, Sarcastic is also very bearish. The same goes for the CCI and also on the RSI. So we'll see whether or not the, the 100 moving average uh, manages to hold. If that breaks, then this could drop all the way down to the 150 down here at 13 at 49. So let's look at the US dollar, Japanese yen. So we continue to go gradually grind slow to the side. And now we're basically intercepting the uh, 20 exponential moving average here at 108. So at this point, if we break below the 20 exponential, then we'll probably head towards the 40 at 107.318. If we rally from here, then we could head towards 110, but it is to be seen. Uh, technical indicators otherwise are very bearish so it may well be that we'll break below the 20 exponential head towards the 40 and then the 50 down here at 106 561. so let's look at the euro us dollar this has also broken significantly to the downside so 0 0.68 percent at this current stage and we have broken the previous lows here and at the moment we're heading towards the 300 moving average right here at 11.69 technical indicators they are very bearish at this point there's quite a lot of room to the downside still here in the bullish band before we find any sorts of uh, support so we may see this fall even further before we see a pullback towards the 20 exponential but we will most likely see a pullback towards the 20 exponential before we go or before we continue towards the 300 moving average down here at give or take 1168 so rallies from here will most likely be sold into as we have tried to rally up towards uh, the 150 the 20 exponential and so on all of them have failed and have basically been sold into so the aussie dollar us dollar this absolutely fell apart today we're down 1.13 uh, percent in the aussie us dollar trading well below the 100 moving average and are heading straight for the 150 moving average here at 0 0.75 technical indicators are very bearish for this currency pair we are significantly overstretched at this point, so we may see a pullback towards the 100 moving average. If we get rejected there, they will probably break really, uh, really hard towards the 150 moving average down here at 0 0.75227. So, um, if we manage to break above the 100 moving average, which does not seem very likely at this point, uh, then we'll have find major resistance at the 20. And the 50 and 40 exponential that are all together right here so let's look at the us dollar canadian dollar now this has absolutely rallied towards the upside 20 exponential that was broken now we're heading toward 40 at 12.58 if that breaks then we have the 50 here which most likely will be tested as we have broken also the middle of the bullinger band here it may well be that we'll head all the way towards the top of the bullinger band and that will mean that we'll go all the way down up towards the 100 moving average at 12.72 uh, technical indicators they are very uh, bullish for this currency pair so we may see this rally to the upside so us dollar has uh, appreciated significantly today and of course that has had major implications for this currency pairs 
um, we are still in the downtrend in the US Canadian uh, dollar um, and we haven't reached the moving averages where we have seen major sell-offs like the like the 50 moving average and the 100 moving average. So that is to be seen whether or not we will sell off this time. So hope you found this helpful. You're welcome to support our channel by subscribing, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos and you're welcome to join us over at Patreon. The link is down below. Good luck and thank you very much. Thank you.